everyone, there's no 18 dapper in this video, it's just me, Vicky. Um, I feel really out of my comfort zone right now, so just bear with me. But thank you very much for requesting a what I got for my birthday video, and let's get started. So the first thing that I received was a gift from myself, and that was I booked us to go away for a few days to York. As I'm getting older, I just really like to use my time to do something different rather than, oh, uh, we went out for a meal. I like to use the time to go to different places, see different things. So that was that. If you haven't already seen the video, there will be a link in the top corner. You can go see that now. But I'll move on to what gifts I received from other people. I'm not doing this in any order. It's just whatever I grab first from out of the bag. So let's go. Um, this is a Yankee Candle incense, it's black cherry and I'm looking forward to putting this in the bedroom or in the hallway so that as soon as I walk into those rooms I can smell this throughout the house. So this was from um, the sister-in-law and brother-in-law so thank you very much. The other thing that I received was these three pink gins, I do like a good gin. I've got loads of gin so it will take me a while to get through these even though they're only miniature size but with them being the miniatures it means that I can take them away with me. I've got Whitley's which is pink cherry gin, I'm looking forward to that. Then I've got the Gordon's pink gin and I've got the Lakes rhubarb and rose hip. I've tried that one before and I can't remember if I enjoyed it so I'm looking forward to having that again. This is a gift I received from the in-laws and they are taking us all to watch The Lion King in Bradford? Yeah, Bradford. So we're all going as a big family so I'm looking forward to that and it's an incredible show so thank you so much. Um, I got a pack of sheet uh, face masks, uh, cucumber and the other one Cucumber and the other one is avocado. This was a gift from the nephew. As you can tell, my skin isn't very good at the moment, so I need this. Thank you very much, Brax. The other gifts I've got are some Yankee tea lights, and these are angel wings. Just smells really nice and fresh and the reason that I've got these is because they have such a good burning time they literally burn for about eight hours and I like to use these underneath my um, wax burner and then the scents just get all around the room and it's lovely and cozy and these were a little gift from Charlie so thank you Oh, I've got a book which is Woman in the Water by Katrina Diamond. I don't think I've ever read any books by Katrina Diamond and this is something that I wouldn't necessarily have gone out and got but Dan saw it and he picked it up and I'm actually really pleased that he did because it's like a murder mystery where a woman's body is found submerged in icy water and police are shocked to find out that she's still alive and then other bodies keep emerging like that so I'm looking really forward to reading this. That was from Dan in case I didn't say that before. Another gift from Dan is this necklace. So I tend to stick to the same jewellery, the same earrings, necklace, ring, blah de blah and I wanted something different so that I can start alternating between those so that's what he got me. Um, I also went into the house of Fraser which you can get really cheap Yankee candles from and this one even though it's a Christmas scent it is so nice. It just smells like cherries and raspberries and just blackberries like loads of fruit like all squished together it's so nice. I don't know where I'm going to put that yet, I might even put it away for next Christmas but this was also a little gift from, Char from the Charlie Bum. This is another one from Dan and like I was saying about the jewellery, I just want to try and 
change up what I'm already wearing. So this is a nice little bracelet. Looking forward to wearing that. Oh, and I've got some chocolates. These were from my dad. <laughs> And I think he did quite a good job, bless him, because by the sounds of it, he went out shopping by himself to get me something. And more chocolates from my dad. These ones are whiskey liqueurs. Oh, truffles. Whiskey truffles. So I think Dan is going to help me to get through those. I'll stick with the chocolate. I got a uh, dark chocolate orange. And as you can tell, there's no orange left in it because I've already eaten that. <laughs> I got some money. I received this from Dan's nan and she does it every year. Um, so I'm not sure what I'm going to use it for. I think I may buy myself a new jacket or a new dress. So I'm going to try and keep that money to one side so that I definitely use it for a gift and not just spend it willy nilly on like canteen food at work. Um, another gift from my dad is this QC Rich Ruby. Um, I've never actually had this but apparently it's like a wine so I'm looking forward to tasting it. But I don't know if, it's, if, it, if I'm going to enjoy it yet. But Dan will help me drink this. Another gift and this is from the niece and it says think happy be happy a special wish bracelet just for you wear this string and your dreams may come true so that's really sweet it's got a little bumblebee on it <laughs> so um, I don't know how big it is I've not tried it on yet but I'm thinking that instead of me wearing it on my wrist because it might get a bit mucky there I'm gonna use it as like an ankle bracelet instead but I'm definitely going to wear it and see if my dreams come true this is another gift from Dan when I can finally get into it and it's a couple of coasters that are Harry Potter themed I'm still trying to get them out um, I've got life is a struggle when you're a muggle got I'd rather be at Hogwarts. I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. And Espresso Patronum. <laughs> that one is going in the living room. Pride of place. And the other ones, one of them will be going in the guest room. And the other ones will be going into the dining room. I really like them. They're a bit of fun. Um, this is another gift from Dan and it's a candle and it's got my star sign which is Aquarius and Aquarius if you don't know runs from the 21st of January to the 19th of February. It's just a little candle and it smells like vanilla. So it's Aquarius. spotted it and I was like you can get me that anything to do with my star sign I love it this is also from the in-laws and um, I haven't actually smelt the Jo Malone candles they are like way out of my price range so these are a dupe but apparently they smell the exact same so I'm looking forward to lighting these and having them around the house. Thank you very much. I've just got two more gifts now. Mm, this one I think is from my mum and dad. Yep. So it's just a trainer. If you could, has it picked up yet? So I say it's just a trainer, but what it signifies to me is like a running trainer because I do enjoy running and that's like my biggest form of exercise. 
and I do try to push myself. So like this year, I am so tempted to try and do the round Donny run, which is an 18 mile run. So we'll see whether or not I manage that. And then the other one is from Dan and it's for my nomination bracelet as well and it's got two glasses that are clinking together and underneath it says cheers. And that's everything I received for my birthday. I am so grateful. Everything I've got I love so the people who went out and got something for me they know me so well. Everything I've got is going to be used and worn and made the most out of. So thank you very much. Hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you for putting up with me and No18 Dapper. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Please put a comment in the section down below. Like the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.